It's an update to a heartfelt story 23 ABC first brought you earlier this week of a local little boy who received a new heart. Braden Eidenshank's mother took to social media today to say, quote, Braden has had a stable night. His numbers and blood work look good. Slow and steady wins the race. Braden spent more than four years on the donor transplant list waiting for a heart, learning on Tuesday that after that long wait, a match had been found. Braden had the heart transplant on Wednesday, which lasted more than 12 hours. Dozens of people came out to the downtown Get Bus Terminal this morning for their food distribution and resource fair. The distribution was held at 22nd and I Street starting at 9 a.m. Fresh fruit and vegetables, pastas, rice and bread and canned food were all given out to people. Officials with Get say it's a way to help people who don't know where their next meal is coming from in our community. They also say Get's goal is to hold food distributions for people four times a year. A groundbreaking ceremony was held in Southeast Bakersfield this morning where a new elementary school will be built. The groundbreaking was held at 10 o'clock this morning on Cottonwood Road in Bell Terrace. Several weeks ago, people were asked to submit names to the district for the elementary school. Some of the names included Harvey Hall, Barack Obama, and even Cardi B Elementary. The name that won out Martin Luther King Jr. Elementary School. The school will be the 44th campus for the Bakersfield City School District and is expected to open in 2020. And I'm Allison Gargaro. We have a gorgeous forecast in store for Friday night football. Temperatures in the upper 70s this afternoon, but then cooling down to 68 degrees by the time the game ends. You can expect chilly overnight lows into the weekend, but temperatures warming up as we head through the weekend. 84 degrees on Sunday, 85 as a high on Monday. That's what's making news this Friday. Thanks for watching.